Two Queen Elizabeth class carriers are currently under construction for the Royal Navy. It is planned that two ships of the class will be built. The first of the class, HMS Queen Elizabeth, was laid down in 2009. It is expected to become operational in 2017. The sister ship, HMS Prince of Wales, was laid down in 2011 and is expected to be commissioned with the Royal Navy in 2020. These will be the largest warships ever built for the Royal Navy. The Queen Elizabeth class ships will be much more capable than the current Invincible class light aircraft carriers. The Queen Elizabeth class warships are capable of carrying over 40 aircraft and helicopters. Once operational these aircraft carries will operate F-35B short takeoff and vertical landing multi-role fighters. These will perform air defense, ground attack and reconnaissance missions. The F-35 Lightning II has low radar cross-section due to stealthy design and radar absorbent materials. These warships will also operate a mix of CH-47 Chinook. Merlin and Lynx Wildcat helicopters for utility in anti-submarine warfare roles. Air Group might also include WA-64 Apache attack helicopters. The hangar accommodates up to 20 aircraft or helicopters. These aircraft carriers will have two elevators for the aircraft. Each elevator can lift two F-35 or similar aircraft from the hangar to the flight deck in 60 seconds. The new aircraft carrier has two smaller islands instead of one larger. The forward island is for navigating the ship, the rear island is for controlling flying operations. The Queen Elizabeth class aircraft carriers will be armed with phalanx close-in weapon systems to counter airborne threats and 30mm naval guns to counter seaborne threats. These new aircraft carriers will have integrated full electric propulsion. The Queen Elizabeth class ships will be powered by a Rolls-Royce Marine Trent MT-30 gas turbine developing 48,000 horsepower. Also there will be four Wartzilla diesel generators. Currently the future of the HMS Prince of Wales is unclear due to funding problems. The decision whether to operate this ship, sell it or mothball it will be taken in 2015. The Queen Elizabeth class will displace 65,000 ton. A size between the USA is 100,000 ton Nimitz class and the French 43,000 ton Charles de Gaulle class aircraft carriers and three times larger than the 20,000 ton UK Invincible class carriers. The carrier will have a maximum speed of 25 knots. At 15 knots the range is 10,000 nanometers and the ship carries food, fuel and stores for an endurance of seven days between replenishments. Each ship will have a complement of typically 1,200 including 600 aircrew.